In this video, we will prove that cos 4 theta is equal to 8 times cos theta to the power 4 minus 8 cos square theta plus 1 and sin 4 theta is equal to 4 times cos cube theta sin theta minus 4 times cos theta sin cube theta. So in order to prove these identities, we will use de Morf theorem. So first of all, we can write cos 4 theta plus iota sin 4 theta as cos theta plus iota sin theta raised to the power 4. By de Morf's theorem, we can make the multiple of the angle the power of cos theta plus iota sin theta. So here we can see that uh, the coefficient of theta is 4 and the coefficient of theta is 4. So this 4 will become the power of cos theta plus iota sin theta by de Morf's theorem. Now we will apply binomial theorem. So we have cos theta to the power 4 plus 4 c1 cos theta to the power 3 multiply by iota sin theta plus 4 c2 cos theta to the power 2 iota sin theta to the power 2 then plus 4 c3 cos theta multiply by iota sin theta to the power 3 then plus iota sin theta whole power 4 now cos theta to the power 4 can be written as cos 4 theta then 4 c1 is 4 then cos cube theta multiply by iota sin theta then plus 4 c2 is 6 and then cos square theta iota square sin square theta now then 4 c3 is 4 cos theta iota cube sin cube theta then plus iota to the power 4 sin 4 theta now this will be equal to cos 4 theta plus iota 4 cos cube theta sin theta then iota square is minus 1 so minus 1 multiply by 6 is minus 6 cos square theta sin square theta then iota cube is minus iota so we have minus iota 4 cos theta sin cube theta and then iota to the power 4 is equal to 1 so we have plus sin 4 theta now we can rearrange this expression so we have cos 4 theta minus 6 cos square theta sin square theta plus sin 4 theta and we can take iota common from these two terms so we have plus iota times 4 cos cube theta sin theta minus 4 cos theta sin cube theta now we can compare real and imaginary parts so here we can see that real part of cos 4 theta plus iota sin 4 theta is cos 4 theta and here the real part is this factor so cos 4 theta is equal to cos 4 theta minus 6 cos square theta sin square theta plus sin 4 theta and if we compare the imaginary part so we can see that here imaginary part is sin 4 theta so sin 4 theta will be equal to this factor so we have sin 4 theta is equal to 4 cos cube theta sin theta minus 4 cos theta sin cube theta now we can further simplify cos 4 theta so cos 4 theta 
can be written as cos 4 theta minus 6 cos square theta and in place of sin square theta we can write 1 minus cos square theta and then plus sin 4 theta can be written as sin square theta to the power 2 and then we have cos 4 theta minus 6 cos square theta then minus minus plus 6 cos 4 theta then plus now sin we can write 1 minus cos square theta in place of sin square theta so we have 1 minus cos square theta whole square now cos 4 theta minus 6 cos square theta plus 6 cos 4 theta plus now here we can expand this factor by the formula of whole square so we have 1 square minus 2 times 1 times cos square theta then plus cos square theta to the power 2 then we have cos 4 theta minus 6 cos square theta plus 6 cos 4 theta then plus 1 minus 2 cos square theta plus cos 4 theta now we can add cos 4 theta and 6 cos 4 theta and cos 4 theta so we will have 8 cos 4 theta then minus 6 cos square theta minus 2 cos square theta will be minus 8 cos square theta and then plus 1 so cos 4 theta is equal to 8 times cos theta to the power 4 minus 8 cos square theta plus 1 so this is what was to be shown